Yeah. Hello everybody, this is Drew Naylor, and welcome to another um, episode of The Legend of Zelda, The Wind Waker. Uh, previously, we got a sword. Did we get a sword? Yeah, we got a... I think we... Did we get a sword? I can't remember. I think we got a sword. But anyway, I know for sure we got a shield. Um, and now we, and we, um, basically what we have to do now is, uh, go after, um, we have to go find, go save Errol, Link's sister. That was a lot of hearts. What we have to do now is walk up to Tetra and talk. Wow, that's a decrepit old shield. Are you sure you, that you can still use that thing? Are you gonna get splinters and cry? Probably not because it looks like it's metal, but anyway. Well, whatever. If you're ready, then let's go. Are you ready? Yep. And now we leave Outside Island. As everybody waves. Well, as most of the good luck, Link. I don't know who is saying that. Good luck finding Errol. Take care of yourself. I don't know who said that. So I just made up a. Made up a, um. Voice for generic people. Or generic group of people. It's Link's grandma. Ugh, how much longer is this gonna going to go on, do you think? Do you have an estimate? Are you sure you you shouldn't just quit right now? Seriously, just think about it. I can tell that you're gonna get more sentimental from here on out. There's still time, you know. Are you sure we shouldn't just turn around and take you back to your island? Well, I mean, there's only one way to save Errol, so... Yeah. As Outset Island fades into the blackness, because this is a loading screen... I don't know where I was going with that. Link, listen, kid. You can't just stand around on deck. You'll get in everyone's way. I've told Nico to look after you, so you better report... You'd better report below decks. And ask him what you should be doing. Okay. Can I talk to you right here? Into the big blue boys. Turn the ship full to starboard. We head for the northern seas. Listen, shrimp. You're really, <laughs> you're really creeping me out. Stand there like that. So quit it, yeah. Way, stay out of my way, way out of my way. Go down below and find Nico. Well, I mean, this would be very uncomfortable. I mean, just look how, see how close Link's face is to the thing. The steering wheel. <laughs> Which is not called a steering wheel, but whatever. Hmm. That Nico didn't make make out half bad. Would you sing the new being the new Swabby and all? New, sw new Swabbies always get stuck doing the hardest work. It's a real raw deal, but hey, I'll tell you, it sure sounds like Nico is happy to finally not be the bottom rung on the pirate ladder. You bet he is. Hey, but don't sweat it. I'm sure that you'll do just fine, so as long as you don't disobey him. Let's go talk to this pirate up here, if there is one up here. Yo! Get out of the way, will ya? Turn around right now, climb down. So, you really plan on going into the Forsaken Fortress? Listen, I'll tell you once you see it. So climb down, will ya? 
So, okay. He just says the same thing. Does he say anything else? Okay, he doesn't say anything else. You can actually... Instead of letting go, right now and having a quarter of your health get lost or more, you can actually press A or uh, instead of having that be the fast way to do things. Um, in losing health in the process or uh, climbing down slowly like that, you can actually just do the Mario 64 technique where you um, just kind of press A, let go, and then just try to keep climbing back up. So, your name's Link, right? Ha ha ha! That's one weird getup you got on there. So, what's the deal? Is that popular back on your island, or what? Now that I think about it, though, I think I've seen an outfit like that somewhere before. You know, come to think of it, I think there's a picture of somebody in an outfit like yours hanging on the wall down in Miss Tetris cabin. What else do you say? You shouldn't. You should know that there's a there's always a test when a new part Swabby shows up. I guess you, I guess you could say it's our way of welcoming new Swabbies. Yep, yes, that it is. One way or the other, you'll figure out what it is that you gotta do once you get below decks. Then be sure to do it. Yep, do it. Just do it. And now, stop right there. This is Miss Tetra's cabin. Most of us real pirates aren't even allowed in here. There's no way we're lighting an outsider, and don't you even think about it. Okay. There's pots on the wall. I gotta break them. Because I'm Link. And that is part of Link's natural, um, instinct. To break pots. If you hear that back there, that noise, that's the um, heater thing. Oh, well, now, ahoy, that swabby. As of today, ahem, I am your superior Nico. Now, I promise I'll go easy on you, so do as I say, okay? Right now, right now. First off, you have to take the test. You have to take the test that all new pirates have to take. It's a bit of a doozy, so get ready. You watch everything I'm about to show you real careful like, so you can cram it into your no doubt mushy swabby brain. First off, you gotta push the switch. It's the only easy part. Just walk up to it and press up on the control stick to step on it. Press the old switch, press. That raises the platforms up. Now check it out. After the platforms rise up from the floor, you gotta jump on them. Like so. Okay, so I was able to jump to this first one myself. But that next one is too far, right? That's when you gotta do this! Maybe. Nope, nope, don't play with my cable. If you jump at the right rope, at, right at the rope, you can grab onto it and use up and down on the control stick to swing. Swing until you get close enough to the next platform, then press A to let go and jump on it. Midi, Midi's, Midi's playing with my cables. Midi, please don't chew on my cables. 
Okay, I'll pet you. Oops. You like that, maybe? Okay. So, do you think you know how to do it? You have to swing from from platform to platform and try to get into the entrance to that room over there. Here's the problem, though, Swabby. The platforms only stay raised for a little while, so you, if you don't get there by the time they drop, you have to start all over. How do you get over there? Hmm. Hacks. I call hacks. It will probably take you at least one year before you're good enough to make it all the way here. One tough, one rough year, one tough year, full of bumps and bruises. Of course, if you manage to do it faster, I'll reward you. Now give it a try. This ought to be good for a chocolate or two. What we really should do is step on this switch first, and then it puts us the platforms down. Then step on this one if Link will let me. Then we run across, and then jump on them. On the ropes. It's not the easiest thing to do. Yep, see, it's not the easiest thing to do. I could have waited a few more seconds. Hey, what are you doing? You have to jump and make it over here. Spelling isn't part of the program, so Wobby. But there's one thing I forgot to tell you. When you're hanging on the rope, yeah, you can move around. I was hoping to get it on my first try, but I didn't think I would. And you always kind of need practice, you know. Perfecto. What? You did it already? Bunch of dots. I, I'm i proud to have you as as my underling. Yes. I wonder if it's okay to just give that to him. I don't... I don't see why not. I doubt I'll get busted. Alright, Swabby, I'll tell you what. You can have the treasure in that chest over there. It's your reward from the great and generous Nico. Hurry and take it before somebody comes. Well, I'm gonna do the opposite. I'm I'm gonna start a slow play of Wind Waker. How about that? Slow play. This is a slow play of Wind Waker. Uh, I actually don't know what a slow play is, but um, yeah, I guess that's what this is, but I can be a little faster. Woo! Broke a bunch of oh, two barrels. Ah. Can I break this one? Actually. Oh, the barrel fell on the floor. Oh, it's so disappointing. You got the spoils bag. You can keep the items that you get from enemies in this handy pouch. It can hold up to eight types of items. Press Y, Z, or X on the item screen to see what's inside. Press Y, Z, or X again to set and use one of its contents. Hey, Link, we've reached the Forsaken Fortress. Hurry and get up here. I can't... Oh, I forgot that voice. For now, I'm going to be pretty terrible at remembering voices, but this is only episode three. That was kind of weird. So you got plenty of time, unless those just stay up there. I think those are just staying up there, because I completed it. Zelda logic. 
Now we have to go back up here. Can I go in there yet? Ahoy there, young shrimpy. It appears that we've actually alive, arrived. Head up to the deck and have a look. See, why don't ya? I, I didn't, I don't remember his voice. I can actually break these barrels too. There we go. Some more rupees that I wasted and I just realized, oh well. Hey, Link, here I am. Up here. Let's talk to this character. Was Nico's, was Nico's test easy? Really? Yep, it was easy. Jump, there we go. The young Mish is waiting for you up above. We have reached the Forsaken Fortress. What are you doing, shrimp? Miss Tetra is waiting for you up in the crow's nest. Shake a leg, yeah? Go, hoof it. Well, I have feet, so... That doesn't really work. Oh, I want to go over here. What do you say? So, that's the Forsaken Fortress. What an evil looking place. He doesn't say anything else. Wait, where did the mask go? Like that thing that goes across, huh? It must have disappeared. Can I go up here, please? Please? Game, let me. Ugh. It's so bore. Oh, I guess the wood goes up there. It's so boring climbing up like this. What were you doing with Nico? Don't tell me that you were just playing some silly game for treasure, were you? Well, actually... Well, whatever. There's something that you need to see. Have a look over there. That's the cursed style known as the Forsaken Fortress. There are all sorts of strange rumor, rumors about this place. What I do know is that long ago, it used to be the hideout of a no-good group of pirates we used to compete with. But they were just small time. Now the place looks like it's pretty dangerous. Ah, I know it. Look. Over there. By, the, by that window. Have you ever seen so many seagulls flock like that before? I'll bet you anything that's the place where they got your sister looked up, locked up, locked up. Ugh. But it looks like the whole place is under really tight guard. This won't work. We'd be spotted before we go anywhere. We got anywhere near landing there. Hmm. What do we do now? I'm worried. Ah, oh, yep. See, I, that's why I was worried. Look, don't struggle. If you really want to get into a dangerous place like that, this is the only way to do it. Trust me. We pirates do this all the time. Don't worry about it. It'll be a piece of cake. Is everybody ready? Never you fear, kid. We're pros. We're gonna launch you good. Three. Two. One. Blast off. Oh, he's gone. He went really far away. If you're wondering about those lines on the uh, the horizontal lines that you see on the recording that's due to my um, component we component cables from monoprice not blaming it on monoprice but 
I'm just saying if you want Wii component cables, get them from Monoprice. But I think it's because of the component cables. Okay, and now I want to jump back in the water. That doesn't do anything, but... Um, actually, we're going to take care of the Forsaken Fortress in the next episode. Um, that's what we're going to do next time. So, um, I, uh, I think this is a good place to stop. Goodbye for now.